All right, boys, Kabuki here, and today we're on the mobile version of Pokemon Unite. I've been playing this on the Switch for about two months now, so I know the ins and outs. I'm going to show you guys the best possible start you can have on this game. And the first thing you want to do is open up the menu, go to practice, and you're going to get a bunch of gold for finishing off the tutorial. They make you do the first one. Uh, it's mandatory, but 2 to 6 is optional. So you don't have to do it and a lot of people skip it but you get a ton of gold for completing that once you're done with that open up the menu again go to events and uh, do the 14 day welcome event you get another 680 gold and also day two you get nine tails so make sure you check in straight away and at day 14 sorry wrong preview you get greninja so don't buy cinderace greninja or nine tails save that unless you want to buy them you do get the gold back say if you want cinderace straight off you do get the gold back once day eight hits so you can just buy them outright you will get refunded the gold uh, once you do get them through the login event so that that's another thing you can do pikachu at the start if you pick pikachu you can actually get a free pikachu from the event right here and you get a ton of gold. Sorry, hold on. Let me find it. Where is it, man? I'm just going through. But that, I think I claimed it already, though. It might be in your mail. So you get a free Pikachu. And then, if you pick Pikachu as your starter Pokemon, you get refunded the gold. So you can have 10,000 gold and buy any Pokemon straight away. And that's like the best piece of advice I can give you. After that, after you collected all your events, you want to go into standard battle. Uh, I highly recommend this. If you want to get into this as fast as possible, get to rank or get to a... Get all your battle items ready. Go to the shop. Uh, I did this myself. Uh, I'm actually running out of time here. Because uh, I only purchased the one day bonus, right? So if you go here, go to enter, go to item, scroll down, and buy the one day XP boost. And that should give you double the XP for a whole day, depending on how it's free to play. Because you get a ton of tickets at the beginning. So just spend 100 tickets and you get double the XP. And you're going to be able to get your free items. And that's going to give you a huge advantage over everyone right so make sure you do that i highly recommend it it's only 100 tickets it's uh it's well worth it because there's a ton of rewards you get ranking up right so you get a venusaur for free i think rank uh unlocks at level six but you need five unite licenses you need five pokemon basically to actually play it so if you want to rush onto ranked and start your grind as fast as possible i highly recommend you buy the xp bonus double xp sorry for a day and then what is else and then you want to get to level 11 right once you get to level 11 you get eject and your next level is 14 i would highly recommend you don't start rank until you're rank 14 so um you're probably wondering why why could be why would i wait for that long to start rank because they give you if we go back to events right now they give you level 30 item enhancers right for free items and the best free items i'm going to go through that in another video but you get level 30 item enhancers once you once you reach level 14 so do that as as fast as possible get your free items pick them and then have them at level 30 and you're gonna have such a big advantage over players that are not doing this so this is by far the best possible start and also once you unlock rank 8 uh you can start doing quick battle go through these challenges they're kind of worth it they don't give that much but it's still worth it to just do them it's a one-time thing make sure you just go through and what's next okay after that is done you can do the check-in bonuses as well uh make sure you do this it's only four battles do the tutorial you get a ton of gold from there you get a choice um a muscle band for free so don't pick up muscle band from the shop you get it for free you do get refunded if you did it beforehand so don't worry and then just go through day one challenges you get a ton of gold day two is the same thing uh, a bunch of gold and some clothing but that's how you get the most amount of gold as fast as possible so you can legitimately if you pick pikachu you can have ten thousand gold to buy any pokemon you want the most expensive pokemon in this game is worth ten thousand so if you want a Greninja, remember you will get refunded for Greninja, so you can do that. Uh, I I highly recommend. Uh, Cinderace is an awesome Pokemon. Actually, just pick your favorite Pokemon. Really, just play. Pick your favorite Pokemon. Go into rank when you're ready and have the items. Don't go into rank without items. Uh, I strongly advise you not to do that because you will get destroyed on players that do have the items and they're just gonna have the advantage over you. But thankfully on the mobile version of this game they were so kind that on the switch version bro it was it was a mess it was a struggle for free to play players but you get free level free 30 items like it's insane 
I, I mumbled that, but like it's insane the value you get. So I picked Charizard. If you want any Pokemon at the beginning of the game for completely free, instantly, right after the tutorial, uh, pick Pikachu. You'll get refunded the gold for Pikachu, and then you can pick any Pokemon you want. You will have 10,000 gold instantly, and you can buy whatever Pokemon you want to main. I highly recommend. Uh, who do I highly recommend? I main Greninja. Uh, Gengar, I'm a jungler, so if you're depending on your role, just pick a Pokemon you want for your role as well. Yeah, but that was it. Pre reg re registration rewards are insane. You get a free Pikachu skin on the mobile version. And is there anything else I want to go over? Play standard battle pretty much until you're le level 14, then go into rank once you have a decent understanding on how the game works. And that's it.